Hey everyone, it's me, George 3 here, with another video about, well, something interesting. What are the lantern wings from DC Comics? What are the lantern quotes from DC Comics? I've heard people talking about this online, and I just wanted to give my two cents in. And from what other online sources I found. What are the lantern wings from DC Comics? The lantern wings are extremely powerful advanced technology with artificial, artificial intelligence that lets the wearer do pretty much anything with enough willpower. It was first made by beings known as the Owens, which created the first Lantern Corps, the Green Lanterns. They also created the Manhunters a while before that, but that's for another discussion entirely. Before I go on, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell for future updates from me. There are around 10 Lantern Corps in total. Each Lantern Corp and the ring is based on the color of DC's emotional spectrum. What is the emotional spectrum, you might ask? Well, in DC Comics, the emotional spectrum, or to be specific, the emotional electromagnetic spectrum, you know, science, is an energy field that is fueled by the emotions of all sentient beings. The spectrum of light is the power source of all the Lantern Corps. Before I go on, I would like to ask if you've ever used Audible before. Audible is an amazing platform that lets you enjoy all your audio entertainment in one place. You always find the best of what you love, or even something new to discover. Audible offers an incredible selection of audiobooks across every genre, from the bestsellers and new releases, to mysteries and thrillers, and even more. Audible has thousands of podcasts, from your favorites to exclusive new series, and even more. And members can try Audible for free today. Visit audibletrial.com slash george3. That's audibletrial.com slash george3. Click the link in the description box, or use the URL shown in your screen right here, to get 30 days for free, and a free audiobook per month. Now back to the video about the Lantern Corps. What are the Corps, and what are the colors you might ask? You have the Green Lantern Corps, and their color is the color green. They can make anything with their willpower. And their weakness is, well, it used to be yellow stuff, but it's not anymore. Now the only weakness they really have is the individual person's willpower. You have the Red Lantern Corps, which is represented by the color red, for anger. Their emotion is anger. And somebody wields their Red Lantern rings, their blood turns to acidic plasma. And it also makes them slaves to Atrocitus, the creator of the Red Lantern Rings, the creator of the Red Lantern Corps. Then you have the Sinestro Corps, which is powered by the color yellow, or fear. It's created by the former Green Lantern, Thal Sinestro. Then there's the Orange Lantern Corps, or the Orange Lantern Corp. There's only one person, or one being, and his name is Larflees, also known as Agent Orange. <laughs> Agent Orange. Sounds funny. But their color is orange. And their emotion is greed. And Larflees, oh my goodness, Larflees is the only orange lantern, really. Anybody he kills, he kills with his lantern ring, pretty much becomes constructs he can use to pretty much do as he pleases. And they can pretty much do the same thing as any other lantern corp ring, except that all the others can't just kill someone and turn them into a construct for them to use. Larflees is greedy and he's a badass. Don't mess with him. I know I won't. He's kind of like General Yamamoto, you know, and his Zaka no Tachi South from Bleach. But the color orange instead of an ashy bone. Then you have the Blue Lantern Corps. You know, the color blue. And their emotion is hope. They are hopeful beings, and whenever they're around Green Lanterns, they make them more powerful. And they can also heal people. They're pretty cool, and they're pretty awesome. Then you have the Indigo Tribe. Compassion, and their color is indigo. They usually made up of very dangerous criminals or people with extreme compassion. And if you don't even have the ability to even think about having compassion, they can literally force it upon you. And if you remove their ring, if it's been on you for a while, that compassion sticks with you. Then you have the Star Sapphire Corps, and their color is violet. And they're all about love. Now, are they the hippie kind of love? I don't think so, but, but there's a lot of information about them out there. I'm just too lazy to look it up. And then you have the awesome ones, the Black, the black Lantern Corps. You have the Black Lantern Corps, and their color is black, and their emotion is death. Or, uh, in actuality, the feeling of death, or feeling of dying. The rings essentially hijack a dead person and brings them back, but not in full. The person's walking around as an undead zombie. The mind's there, and everything's working, but the soul in the DC Comics universe, people have souls. And the, and souls, the souls, souls aren't really there, it's just the rings controlling it. And the ring gains the knowledge of the person that's wearing the ring. So they can torment the person that they're after and rip, so they their, rip heart their heart out. And do whatever it is that they needed to do with their heart. And then you have the White Lantern Corps. And their color is life. You have the White Lantern Corps. And their color is white. And their emotion is life. Or the feeling of being alive. They can bring the dead back to life. And they can even warp reality along with all the other things other Lantern Corps are able to do. And they're pretty awesome. And pretty cool. 
and very powerful. You would not want to mess with them. Of so those are the main Lantern Corps of DC Comics. There's also a few others like the Ultraviolet Corps, which runs on negative emotions. But that's for another video to discuss. What Lantern Corps would you think would suit me properly? Out of all the ones listed here, here are the ones I'd most like. Here's all the ones I'd most likely be in based on my own biased perspective of my personality. The Green Lantern Corps, the White Lantern Corps, or the Blue Lantern Corps. And personally, I choose the Blue Lantern Corps. I choose hope because I'm very hopeful, even to a fault. But that's just who I am. I'm hopeful about a lot of things. And while I do like the color white, I'm alive, and I know that, but I'm not life itself. If you understand what I'm trying to say. And green, while I do have willpower, I smoke cigarettes. I don't have the willpower to quit that, at least not right now. So, I don't have as much as much willpower as I think. Plus, I hate green. I can't stand the color green at all. I do not like green. Anytime you see green and me, I don't like it. If I even look at it, it makes me want to vomit. I'm just not a fan of anything green. I'm just not. Which is why I would choose the Blue Lantern Corps. The Hope. The Hope. But hey, I won't know for sure until I get one. Maybe I will get the blue one. I have no idea. What Lantern Corp would you belong to? What wing would you get? What do you think I would get? What would you do if you actually got one of these wings, really? Could we ever reach a technological advancement threshold in which we could create wings like these, realistically? Maybe one day, but who knows? So, that's all I have to say about this. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, hit that subscribe button and notification bell for future updates from me. Leave a comment down below, tell me your thoughts. Share this video, you know, just because. Check out my Patreon. Check out my Patreon. You can support me on there for as little as a dollar a month. And I'd appreciate it very much. And I'm very hopeful about it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Take it easy and uh, see you next time. Bye. So, I wanted to say thank you all for watching. I appreciate every single person who viewed this video. Thank you. If you have any comments or thoughts, leave them be in the comment section. Tell me your thoughts in the comment section, please. I read every single one of them. If you're not already subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you get notified when I upload next. And uh, yeah, have a great day.